because there's been this incredible story out of the New York Post. It's based on a new book about royal etiquette and it informs us that the Queen eats a banana with a knife <laughs> and fork. Have a look at this etiquette expert explaining to us how it happens. This is how the Queen would eat a banana. We don't peel it like a primate. Instead, using the fork, we hold it in place and cut off one end. Then we cut off the other end. And then we turn the knife on its side and go into the skin like so. And then prising it open. And then cut a little bit off and eat like so. It's just too good, Justin. <laughs> You'd think she'd have someone to do that for her, but I say this having realised that this morning I actually cut up a banana with a knife because I was trying to get a frozen one into my son's smoothie. But have you ever eaten a banana with a knife oh, no. and fork, Justin? It's... No, mate, I can't say I have. Uh, when I look at that and I look at the kind of people uh, that are doing those practices, I, I just think, can't we get rid of these people? It, it is time. <laughs> well, it's not They're just royalty. They're it's, out of touch. They're crazy. No, Can they we get rid of them. They just don't want to please. touch their bananas. What it reminds me of is George Costanza in Seinfeld. <laughs> trying to class up this place. <laughs> They're trying to have the Yankees reach another strata of society that might not watch Channel 11. <laughs> eating my dessert. <laughs> How do you eat it? With your hands? <laughs> You're not so uncouth, are you, Liz, as to eat a banana with your hands? I do, I do, Chris, and I'm unashamedly so. Uh, this is a lot of effort not to appear like a primate. I mean, it's, seriously, well, just way, the, way too much effort here. You've hit the nail on the head, Liz. Thanks for joining us, Liz and Justin. Uh, Liz hit the nail on the head. Uh, why pretend not to be a primate? We are primates, aren't we? I better check my biology, but I think we are.